Hi, this is your boy Joe. Today's topic is Font Awesome 5 just released. Hey guys, this video is brought to you by viewers like you and people that support our website, codingphase.com. Go check it out. Over 20 courses in there that's going to guide you to become a developer from the beginning to becoming a pro. Okay. All right, guys. So we're going to talk about Font Awesome. Font Awesome was one of those things that everybody has used in the past and you know i believe i, I started using font awesome i think at version two or three one of those two all right um basically somewhere last year sometime last year they came out with this idea of like you know doing a kickstarter and basically saying hey guys we're gonna come out with font awesome five and we want you guys to support us and you know show some love and to be honest with you guys i think i gave him like five dollars or something like that uh something you know something small but i donated something right uh i think they made like a million plus or even more than that uh let me see what was the exact number font awesome uh kickstarter Let's see right now. Like they even got a professional, uh, you know, film crew to record their commercial. Like they really went out, out their way. All right. So let's see how much they got. Okay. So they pledged 35,000 people paid and basically uh, they made a million dollars. That's not bad. That's actually not bad. You know, when you think about it, it's really not bad. Like they really did their thing. Um, I mean, everybody uses this thing is great, especially for the people that started with bootstrap, like, you know, font awesome, like even bootstrap use font awesome, you know, all over their, their website, you know, for icons. So even at that, like millions of websites use their icons every single day. So at the end of the day, they finally got paid. <laughs> they finally made some money out of this, you know, so that, that goes to show you guys, like sometimes you come up with a project. That could be that simple. You're like, oh, it's just some icons, right? Hey, we put in a CDN and it's out there, right? And then you're like, oh, how can we make money? Oh, don't worry about it. We'll think about that later on. <laughs> and that's exactly what they did. It's like they got the service out. Uh, it became very popular, all right? And then now it's like it's all over the place, right? So now let's go to the website. So fontawesome.com. I think it is great what they did. They have two versions. They have the version that is with CSS. Uh, they also have a new version with, uh, I believe, is JavaScript and SVGs, uh, which is pretty cool because if you, you have SVGs, you could control the whole icon by itself. Like, you could animate the whole icon. So that's pretty cool. Um, let me see. What else can you do to this thing? I mean, there's a lot of stuff. All right. But of course, now, I don't know, I'm, I'm a little bit torn by this because. And, and that's coming from somebody who's a, a content creator. All right. But I'm also a fan and I'm also somebody who who uses a lot of services. Um, I'm kind of torn about it. Uh, the fact that you got to go pro to get uh, like the light features like, OK, like let's say this is like the icon, right? Uh, what they did, let me see if they, they have one. I'm going to show you one that maybe it's a little bit different. Let's search for the TV icon, right? So you could actually notice exactly what they did. So there's the TV icon, all right? And down here, you can see how the original looked, all right? Maybe you could zoom in a little bit. Let's see, yeah. So, oops. Okay, so the, this is the original one. Now, the one that they're using uh, for the latest one is a little bit thicker, okay? Um, this one's a little bit more square. This one's a little bit more rounded uh, at the bottom. Like, it, they did a couple of little changes, you see? Like, this is a little bit shorter at the bottom. This is a little bit bigger at the bottom. Uh, there's less space between the TV and the stand on the new one. So, you could actually tell like the differences that they did okay 
But the thing where I'm torn about is the fact that it's like, hey, man, you could use the solid one, which is the normal one, right? Then you have the regular one, and then you have the light one. So the light one is the one that everybody would love to use because when you have light icons, it just looks more cleaner, right? It's the same thing as fonts. If you look at, let's say, Roboto, and you put in, I think, a font way of 100, a font way of 300, the lightness of it just makes it look very nice and clean and very modern, right? But now, to even get the pro license, like, you got to pay $60, like, to me, for icons, I'll be honest, like, that's a little bit too much. I'm being honest. You know, standard license, seats five, seats 100, like $1,200 per year, five, five seats, $60 per year. So I don't know about this. You know what I mean? Like, and that's coming from me. I'm a creator. I have my own website. I create courses. I create uh, tutorials, whatever you want to call it, right? Um, I just started doing this a few months ago, right? I've been a developer for over, you know, five, six years, right? Professionally. I started when I was 14, but professionally, I could say, hey, man, I, you know, I started in 2012, my first job. Okay, so from 2012 to now, we're in 2018. You do the math, okay? So that's coming from me. For a license, $60 a year, especially after you, you already got so many people pledging and giving money to you. Like a million dollars is a lot of money. You get what I'm saying? Like like the community gave you a million dollars, but now you're like, uh, you know what? We're going to make this something that used to be free. We're going to make it a pro version. So it's like we fund it. <laughs> That's where it's like. I'm a little bit torn. It's like, yeah, I only pay five dollars. Yeah, somebody else donated, you know, whatever, right? A hundred dollars. There's companies out there that, you know, they they added what they pledged to like. Matter of fact, what was the minimum pledge? I think so. Yeah. So, okay, found out some pro. Okay, so I pledged twenty dollars. All right, uh, that was like the minimum that they had. I don't remember. I know it was the, the minimum. I don't remember if it was five or, or 20 or 10. I know I paid the minimum. But, you know, there's people out here who pledge $2,000, $3,000. Like, you got a couple of things in there, like five T, TX t shirts, whatever. Like, I just don't know. Like, I just don't know. I feel like. You know, it's like I funded your your campaign because I'm thinking in my head, I, I didn't read everything. And sometimes it, it's crazy because sometimes we, we sign up to things and we don't read what exactly we're signing up to. Uh, but, yeah, like I, I pledge into this thing thinking, oh, cool, they're going to come out with a couple of new features and everybody in the community is going to be able to, you know, have, you know, it's like. I wasn't pledging for, hey, man, I'm going to pledge to upgrade your, your website and, and put some money in your pocket just for the hell of it. It was more like, hey, man, I'm pledging to this because you guys helped out the community. And if you guys are going to continue that same help and, and that service that you guys were giving to everybody in the community and with a couple of upgrades, then cool. Go ahead. Take my money. And it's like I'm paying for myself and I'm paying for everybody else who can't pay for it. You know, uh, I'm really big on that. You know, you guys know me uh, on my website, do the same thing, the same, you know, a lot of people pay for it. Some people that come from third world countries and, uh, you know, countries that they don't have anything. Guys who are younger than 17 years old, uh, you know, just in high school or junior high school and they want to become developers. I give them free access to my website. Right. Everybody knows that. OK. Uh, and that's why I supported this campaign to pretty much just like, OK, help it, promote it at the same time and, and just get it out there. And and just people get to use it. Right. It's like we paying for it because we are a little bit more pri uh, privileged than others who can't come in and, and pay for it. Right. So that's what I thought we was doing. I did not know that we was it's like, hey, man, you're the only one that's going to get fun. Awesome pro and 
pretty much like font awesome pro is what people want like that's I, I don't know i feel like that's what i pay for i pay for you know for people to be able to have access to this thing because it was free before and now i don't know <laughs> i don't know man i hope you guys understand what i'm coming from it's like to me i'm like wait for us to use if i tell like one of my students like hey man go check this out and uh i want you guys to go and go and use uh whatever the light one right now they can't use the light one you get what i'm saying like i don't know man like that's the only thing that i'm i'm a little bit torn about you know it's like people got to pay for a font awesome five pro like I just don't know, man. I feel like I got bamboozled, <laughs> bamboozled into this thing. <laughs> but hey, man, more power to them. Uh, but yeah, Font Awesome is is currently uh, released. The new website is up. It looks beautiful. Uh, whoever did this website, I love their design. I love the fact that they they came in and, and did something legit. It wasn't like you know a half ass website. I mean, you got a million dollars. You got to do something decent. You get what I'm saying? Like, let somebody throw a million dollars at me. You see what I do with that. You know what I mean? Like, and you probably think like, man, a million dollars is not that much. But listen, man, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. And I don't even think their their team is that big. So pretty much there was a, a, a very good pocket change <laughs> for everybody that was involved in, in this project. So. I don't know. It, it's cool. I just wish that the, you know, the GoPro at least would be more cheaper than that. Like, this is icons. You, you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't see this like as a major, major service. Like, for $60, I'd rather, to be honest, for $60, if I'm going to pay $60, I'd rather go you know, to um, Fiverr.com and pay a designer to create the, the icons for me. To be honest with you, if I'm going to pay $50 or $60 to go pro, right? I already have it. I'm pretty sure I have it because that's what they said on the thing. If you pledge, you get you get the pro already, personal business license already. All right? So I, I probably got it. I just got to log in. So I'm good. I'm talking about the people who are not, uh, you know, who didn't pledge and and didn't have any money at the moment or whatever. Or didn't even know about this whole Kickstarter, right? Like, they're missing out on a lot. So, it's like, if I was one of those people, I'm like, man, pay $60 for some icons. Like, I kind of would rather just pay a designer to build custom icons for me. You get what I'm saying? Like, but I don't know. That's just me. Anyways, guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again. Codingface.com. Your boy's back and I done did it again. Guys. Go to my website, codingface.com. Go check it out, man. Go give it a chance. If you've been, you know, jumping from company to company, uh, website to website, trying to figure out how to become a, a web developer, listen, I have a whole bunch of courses there, man. Over 20, I think we up to like 25 courses. Yeah, 25 courses right now. And there's more coming this week. So it's like, there's like a, a never ending thing. It's like you get constant courses, constant content, like all day, every day. It's like, <laughs> and listen, and you could just literally subscribe, get the all access pass. Let's say preview as locked out user coming here. Uh, if you go and use the coupon code from YouTube, it basically gives you uh, automatically 50% off on everything. On my website, this 20 becomes 10, this 150 becomes 75, this one-time purchase becomes 150. So pretty much for what you could pay for the yearly, you could get it for one-time purchase. You say, hey, I'm buying this one time. That's it. And then forever you're getting unlimited courses. It's up to you, man. Um, at the same time, like you guys know, we come here, whatever we earn from this, we help other developers who can who can't afford the courses so it's like i don't know if we could call it it's like communism or like uh what's the other one uh, i forgot the the thing that they have like in uh <laughs> norway or something where it's like hey you 
you have this much, and it's like we redistribute it to everybody else who can't get anything, right? So, anyways, that's what I do. We in here, well, we're not doing this to become millionaires. We're here to pretty much help the community and just pretty much pay the lights. That's it. Nothing crazy. I don't need, uh, you know, I don't need a million dollars in my bank account. All I need is just to survive. That's it. That's that's my train of thought. You know what I mean? So that's the type of person I am. So yeah, man, we here. Go support the website. And listen, guys, we got a brand new site coming out for you guys pretty soon. Codingface.com getting a revamp. Uh, a super uh, edgy website. Legit. Like, oh, man, I don't even know what to tell you guys. <laughs> It, it has it's gonna have so many things man it already has a, a lot of cool things like all the courses that you guys already love but we adding so many other features man like this is gonna be your one-stop shop if you are a developer all right guys so it's your boy joe back at it again codingface.com wow